Bro. So. Oh, okay. I just got to like. What what was your take on uh, what Dorolo did during that chase? Uh, I I well okay. So first thing as far as is well, if they could the the reaction was definitely in my opinion not appropriate. Uh, I mean she like got very very angry, very mad, very frustrated, lost her temper really quickly for the radio and like yelled at you. But like, what's the worst part of all is like. Yeah, I mean, you know, you're supposed to have your lights on, but as she soon was as you like a turn mile them, away. <laughs> yeah, I think it's because you said over the radio, you said, I'm going to turn my lights off real quick. And then that's when she got like really angry about it. Um, yeah. But like as soon as you turned on, turned back on your lights, you guys almost died. Yeah, exactly. And like it was a very dangerous thing. And I mean, yeah, you know, lights always on during a pursuit. I get, you know, which makes sense. But like, brother, we went from her saying that well okay so that's my, that's my that's the first thing is i felt like her reaction rate was way too way too much uh but then like we were code six in and i said i'm gonna give the pursuit like you know i'm gonna code six three four we're gonna code six three four more minutes right and like not even 30 seconds she just you know says hey uh, so breaking off so i'm back channel one and like shut we up didn't she, you didn't hear that you were still no. code six she 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 left the the call early and i like i had not called it off like i was i was a primary Bro. on it and i had made it clear that like you know we're gonna code six three four more minutes and before i'm like while we're still code six in and looking i you know she communicates the rail uh you know whatever shit like you know, that makes me want to get spread. back on duty i'm gonna be honest with you um i i'll tell you right now i was so beside myself of how much how idiotic that was my immediate reaction to Koda is uh, was, is she a fucking idiot? <laughs> like, you're, you're, like, you want to get us killed and scream. And we, not only did we lose her because of that decision, um, but it cluttered the comms. And then to, now you're telling me that she broke off immediately? Like, why the fuck do you, are you joining Chases uh, if you're not interested in apprehending suspects, which is fundamentally why we have a job? And so I, yeah. uh, I, I started writing my statement immediately. Cause I'm like, how the fuck is she a senior officer? Um, like, have you ever been in a pursuit? My God. Uh, how are you making that call while you're a mile away? Cause you can't drive for shit and not understand the calm I was giving is cut the lights so you can pass me and not die. Now. Then she goes and approaches me over at, at the end of that last situation, right? So yeah. I, because the thing is, like, if you got an issue, fucking pull the officer aside, right? Not yeah. uh, complain about it over radio. That's literally, uh, you know, the opposite. Well, of yeah, like, we had, I mean, like, yeah, oh, we were getting yelled. You, you, you got yelled at over the radio, and then that cleared the comms. Then when you turned on your lights and did do what she asked, yeah. then you, you almost died because the so, local turned into you and you went I'm flying. Like, yeah, exactly. So, if, I, if there's an issue, like, you know, bring it up after the fact, not in the middle of a fucking pursuit. Um, especially, you don't know what, what that pursuit is going to escalate into, right? You're still on them. We're crashed out. Da, 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 da. Anyway, she pulled me aside, uh, pulled me aside afterwards. And um, she's like, you know, I apologize, blah, blah, blah. And, I, you know, I gave her a little piece of my mind. I was like, you know, I found that, like, rather unprofessional. And, um, you know, I... That's something that could have been handled after the fact. And I, I asked for clarity. I'm like, are we not allowed to, you know, cut the lights as we're like in those circumstances? Right. And she said, no, it's uh, now a part of our procedure or something like that, which I kind of refuse to believe. Um, I'd already planned to talk to uh, Aldo about it just so it's like noted or whatnot. Um, but you heard what the announcement was. Yeah. By Ruth in the beginning. This yeah. fucking snake is I, went I, I and was just about apologized, to say that. Just... said she was in the wrong, and then goes and complains to Ruth. Yo, fuck her. <laughs> I, I, you know, when when I saw the announcement, yeah, so not only did he announce there was an official, she probably thought I was gonna report this, and decided to, yeah, you know, and and if you look at the announcement and the wording. You should always have your lights on during the pursuit, which is a complete, um, 
you know, I don't think she picked up on what was stated to begin with. So I'm a, I'm a make sure this is sorted. Let me put aside the fact that this dumbass got out, out, out of her uh, vehicle and stood on top of the suspect car in uh, the last pursuit while they're ramming. <laughs> well, that, well, then my, that, that, the worst part. In my oh, opinion, what the fuck I, is I, going I, on? What am I witnessing? I don't know, man. I, Suarez, I don't know. what the I, fuck am I witnessing? She, she is getting, uh, in, I don't know if you noticed her communications and whatnot, but she is just very, uh, <laughs> like even during that last call, I could hear it in her voice. She just sounded like very, like, not, I don't want to be here. She sounded her, like it, someone that should not have been promoted and is trying to um, assert, uh, assert, what's the word like I'm looking power? for? Uh, assert. Dominance, power, mm, I don't. Uh, do, 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 do. Um, make herself seem like she's knows what the fuck she's talking about. Uh, uh, it's it's very dangerous uh formula yeah when well, someone yeah, doesn't know yeah. what the fuck they're talking about and they're you know if i talk loudly and assertively people are gonna buy into my bullshit yeah i i i've noticed like big things with her is she just sometimes she she does not uh she she gets she just goes off the rails sometimes in my opinion like yeah. even during that pursuit like yelling at yelling it over the radio so the way and until after the fact or saying all right turn your lights back on and it's just uh the way it was it happened was bad and then she broke off the call early when we were still code six and i said we were still code six in and i she just left the channel uh without asking if it was good to break off or anything how dare uh, you because she was just mad um and then like on that latest call like i could hear it in her voice she just didn't sound she sounded like she didn't want to be here like she was like i don't know like it was just the, her tone her way she yeah. handled the situation and so it's just I don't know. I uh, mean, a lot of concerns. Yeah, I've got a. Uh, honestly, I had put most of this beside me, but um, that was textbook. I fucked up. I need to go. Uh, you know, I'm. Uh, yeah, this is definitely. Uh, I just can't believe that it went to announcement, and then not only did it get announced how verbally, do you go from it got apologizing announced written saying too. you fucked up, and then go and complain to the captain. Oh, she's on my shit list. Listen, here's the thing. I, yeah. You heard that announcement by Molten, right? Yeah. Listen, I, 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 uh, I, I'm going to start getting on duty more. I mean, yes. Please. Yeah, this, this shit cannot happen. And that includes it's the shit talking of Ruth. Um, or, or all this bullshit. If people need to get dapped, they need to start, you know, taking fucking accountability. Um, but at the very same time, um, you know, the, the fucking horse shit behavior, uh, that I witnessed, if that's happening by, by senior officers, goddamn, I'm going to be bringing it up. Um, well, now, I mean, yeah, if I get fucked an issue and you with... ask for it, so be it. I mean, I'll just go back to the president, you know? Yeah. I mean, that I mean, motherfucker yeah, that, made the, me the come here. Is... And, uh, you know, I've, uh, you know, I have literally nothing to lose. So I think it just also, it's not helping with, uh, morale. Like it just does, it makes her, it makes it very come off, come off as she's not approachable, you know, and that's, that's not a good thing, right? Cause you always want your higher ups to be approachable and be able to talk to them. Yeah. Um, but. Narrator says Brian I, still barely just, comes it, on it, duty. My, the craziest <laughs> part about all this to me is the fact that it went from that pursuit to immediately getting to the captain, to immediately getting announced, to immediately getting announced verbally, announced written. Uh, it's literally an announcement on MDT now. I'm starting I, to understand a little bit why Aziz and Cornwood were frustrated. And I'm kind of starting to kick myself a little bit thinking about it. Like, I, I do think that they were both acting like little bitches. You don't know the context of what I'm saying right now, probably. Um but i'm starting to wonder if uh what some of the root cause here was um because like holy fucking shit yeah and, and it's just a concern too with the daps and whatnot and everything is like and you know i'll probably so i'll probably say this uh to uh one of the auditors but is just a concern of like 
if you bring up this issue, like, let's say, you know, like if, let's say I brought up this issue to Sonya or whatnot, I feel like it would just go against me because like now I'll be getting checked to make sure on my, you know, I, I, I didn't leave a bandage in my glove box or right? I'll be making sure like, hey, if I do this, then I'm getting, I'm for sure going to get that because they're going to be pushing for it. It's like, uh, it's like a, a revenge thing now, you know, because it feels like, you know, that that's what it feels like will happen and it's a it's a worry of like getting um, dapped or bringing yeah. up you know, proper concerns because now you know she's or anyone is just not happy with it you know it's just re retaliation like oh you want to bring it to the captain that you know i i, said I mean you you can fine. you're right i'll take the das but you know well, we watch this you know and then they're well, gonna start auditing the repairs and make, you know what i mean yeah uh, which is you know here, here's the thing though right um hmm I, I'm gonna I'll reserve my kind of judgment on that. I'm I uh retaliatory uh reporting and stuff like that, that's always gonna be a thing, right? We're a police department, people are always gonna be chasing rank, um, sucking on toes, all that kind of thing. Uh, that that's never gonna change, right? Um we're kinda forced to like work uh with each other and as long as we're finding a way to like come to some kind of like uh understanding, to me that's what kinda matters the most. Um but I just wish it wasn't this. I just wish it wasn't like this. You know, like I don't know. I I, I don't want to have to worry. Like uh, us officers should be working together and going together, not going straight to a captain saying, you know, saying this yeah. that, thing, and then you know, yeah. like, I don't know. Like, and that's just what happened. It's that's a it's a coping mechanism. Off. I mean, it, it it all it it's all it is. Um, however, uh, to me, um, I I, I mean, listen, I I'm a pretty, what's the word, stoic motherfucker right i have an idea as to how punishment should be handled and that includes uh you know making sure the guidance is there and only uh pressing things uh if it seems like the other party uh doesn't understand the why um yeah. stoic the right word honestly S -S i don't know what that means i don't i i actually you're the first person i've ever heard in my entire life say the word stoic how the fuck have you seen it written? Oh. Never even seen it written before. Where the hell did you learn that word from? From reading? Sto what books stoic? did you read that someone stoic? said, like, the author sat there and stoic. thought, oh, wow. I said I stoic originally, but then, well, you not stoic. knowing the word. No, I said stoic originally, and then, didn't I? You said stoic. Okay, stoic? I, probably, I said that afterwards, because you didn't. I think I said it afterwards. Did I say it afterwards? I don't know. You said stoic. Stoic, though. I'm just going to tr trust Twitter here. I meant stoic. Yeah. But is oh, that even okay. the right word now? <laughs> I, I don't even know. I, I still also have not heard that in any book or... Chad, ever. did I say it originally? My entire life. Yeah. That was not in my English class. <laughs> well, shit. All right. Let's get out there. Yeah, sounds good. You scuffed it? You said it wrong first? <laughs> Is it even the right word? Someone put the definition in chat. We gotta get some hinges on these so that you don't have to close it with your body. You can just. Oh, that close would it be nice. Mm -hmm. 